Bridget. And I'm Sonia. And today we had a very special guest in the pop office. Check it out. So my name is Alfredo and I, um, I, I'm a videographer, I'm an editor, and I'm also a music video director. And uh, we've been on, been on tour for like the last year with Justin on this My World tour. And you know, put together uh, a lot of footage for the, for the movie, a lot of viral videos, and, um, and put together all the videos for Pop, all your Schools for All video. We did, we did a couple of videos with, with Dan, Kenny, and Ryan that will be coming out soon. I, I did a video with myself. And, um, and uh, yeah, that's me. As promised, we have a tradition. When someone comes in the office, we hold a lunch and learn session. A lunch and learn is when a new member comes into the office, they are asked to share their story to the office, and then ask us a question. We then go around the room, tell us about ourselves, ask that question, which can be about anything, and then we meet and greet in the process. If you guys could be in any one particular place, like in a moment in history, like which, which, which place would you want to be? It just blew my mind. That's a lot <laughs> of question. I kind of wish I was 18 in like 1991, you know, so I could have grown in uh, my profession with the 90s as it was at its peak, because now it's just a dying form. Do you think we could bring it back? <laughs> I'm hoping. <laughs> now, if I had to pick like a historic moment to see, uh, I would have liked to see Highlight like Martin's speech. Yeah. That would have been cool. Well, yeah. Yeah. Or like the Titanic sailing. That, that is a good one. Tight. That is a good one. We watched it from the iceberg though. Like yeah, yeah. <laughs> 1912 just to see the Titanic. That's like, a good one. That would have been, to actually be there. That would be cool. Definitely. It's not until I got older and I was able to like search on the internet where I got to see the old school videos, you know? It's right. so, like in 98, 99, I didn't have internet. Some people probably did, but I did it. So I didn't know anything but what was on TV. So when I saw like those videos, that was so cool. I wanted to do videos like that, and that was like my first inspiration. I would be a teacher, be a teacher? for sure. Yeah, awesome. I would be a teacher for sure. If I would have to teach any subject, oh, I would probably want to teach video and film and stuff. But if I couldn't, I would probably go for English. Yeah, yeah. I definitely wanted to be a teacher most of my life. You know, because you really have the power to shape them in the future. And I feel like, and I feel like. You know, I feel like when you're growing up and you're like in your elementary years, I feel like there's certain teachers that really stick out and, and if you motivate and push these kids um, the right way, they're going to lead a great future. And I feel like, and I feel like, you know, a lot of kids don't have the, the support at home from like their parents or from their guardians for that push. So like, I kind of want like teachers to take that responsibility because that is their second home for kids, their second home to school. So it'll be really cool. Adam talk about Princess of Promise and one of the building us from and now I see and he's like 30 schools in and he has offices and, and it's just this whole big thing it's 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 crazy it's true what they say like never say never dreams come true it's such a cliche but it's, it's really true Adam is a perfect example you know it's, it's awesome to see that he has all this now yeah, yeah it's cool it's cool and I want to go to these schools so like I want to go with Adam uh, we've been talking about it I've obviously we've been on, I've been busy on tour but I want to go with Adam and, and do a, a video out there with these kids and, and stuff because you know, I wanted to be a teacher my whole life. This organization is like so awesome to me. You know, I love this organization. So I, I can't wait. Hopefully we'll make it happen. Like uh, we were talking about this fall maybe. So that would be a really cool, interesting kind of concept video. Of course. Do you have any preference of where to go? The experience is just like like what it would be for the promise, just to see the kids and meet them and see the school and see them work. It's like those things that like dreams are made of, like you know, to see that and actually be there. There's so many people who don't know about pop and like exactly. know about kids and what school and what one I know you guys know the story of Adam about Adam giving right. the pencil like you know that whole thing, but it's an incredible story, you know, and that's a story that'll live on forever, even past, past all of us, like a hundred years from now, when Princess of Promise is doing crazy things, you know. So it's, it's just it's just really cool. It's really